Any effective chemical program can be greatly influenced by how the chemical is introduced to a flowing process. This video is an experiment demonstrating the difference between intermittent and continuous injection. Scrolling across the top is a second camera angle showing the top view of the process. Traditionally, higher volume pumps with timers have been used to provide intermittent injection. A typical intermittent pump is shown on the right injecting red dye at 10 quarts per day. The periodic nature of intermittent flow results in significant portions of the flowing process not being treated. This reduces the effectiveness of the treatment and may prevent it from providing any benefit at all. An accurate continuous injecting pump can have a significant positive impact on the chemical program, resulting in an effective treatment and a reduction in chemical usage. On the left, injecting green dye is a serious fusion pump set to 10 quarts per day. The dots provide a visual representation of the accuracy and repeatability of the serious continuous injection pump. A more in situ representation can be generated by lowering the nozzles to touch the paper, therefore eliminating the fluid surface tension and simulating what really occurs in a process stream. Now you can visualize how the continuous flow series pump provides constant effective treatment of the process. This is achieved using a fully variable speed BLDC motor, proprietary control technology, and a precision short stroking pump. This uniform and continuous flow ensures that the chemical has the best opportunity to disperse both radially and axially in the flow stream. Radially meaning across the pipe and axially meaning up and down the flow stream. Axial dispersion cannot be achieved using intermittent flow. Uniform stream treatment with a continuous injection serious fusion pump allows you to effectively treat the process, reducing chemical and protecting your assets.